Hello guys and welcome back. So now in this video we will create our minimap using render textures. So as you know that this is our whole environment. Okay. And we want to show this environment inside our minimap. So if we focus up on the player right here we have this player game object. Now in order to create the minimap first of all let me just select all of these gangsters with the boss and let's click on create empty parent and let's name this parent as gangsters okay now we have some space in the hierarchy so now for the minimap let's create a camera and let's name this as mini map camera and make sure that this minimap camera is at the same position as your player so we can just click on the player copy the transform of the player and click on then the minimap camera and click on paste component values that's it now after this let's make the minimap camera position y as 15 and then let's rotate it on the x-axis by 90 like this so now as you can see you can see the minimap camera right here and after this from the minimap camera remove any other components than the camera component okay now after this we want our minimap camera to render this whole scene just like our main camera okay so if we select the main camera let's copy this whole camera component and click on minimap camera and right here click on paste component values then let's click on this projection and change this to orthographic as you can see right here now if we click on this game view as you can see it shows everything as flat okay if we change it back to perspective it shows a little bit 3d but if we change it to orthographic as you can see it now shows as a flat 2d scene as you can see now after this you can choose the size of your zoom like this okay if you want the camera to be zoom in this position okay if you want to show the whole map then you can show the whole map but if you want to show some part of the section then you can do that as well so i will just simply leave this as 10 and also right here make the clipping plane near to zero now after this let's create a ui canvas let's name this canvas as minimap canvas then in here let's create a ui raw image because we don't want to show our minimap like this on our entire screen okay we want to show this minimap uh, in some section area okay just as you saw in the introductory video right here we showed the minimap okay so let's name this raw image as minimap and right here the difference between the image and raw image that in the raw image it needs a textures instead of a sprite okay in the image it needs the sprite right here and the reason we are using this textures is because we will render our minimap okay we will create a texture for it and then we will show that texture right here on this minimap now let's change back to the scene view let's go into 2d mode and right here let's focus up on the minimap okay as you can see right here we have this minimap so now you can show this minimap anywhere you want but i will show my minimap right here so let me turn on the gizmos as you can see right here we are showing the health bar as well okay and with the health bar we will show the minimap as well so let's make the minimap react transform to bottom left and if you check our game view as you can see there it is now what we can do with it is let's move it a little bit up there and that will be it if you check it in the game view as you can see here is our minimap after this let's make the width of our minimap camera as 400 by 300 okay and now we can position this again somewhere right here okay so now if we check it out in the game view as you can see here is our minimap 
you can actually decrease the size of your minimap okay if you want but i will leave my minimap like this and guys as i told you that we will render our whole scene okay and then we will show that whole scene right here on the minimap okay so it is actually called render texture so for that let's go inside our assets folder and right here let's create a render texture and let's name this as minimap render texture and if you select this minimap render textures right here you will see all of these options now the only changes which we will be doing right here is to change the size according to our minimap width and height so it is 400 by 300 so if we click on our minimap render texture right here type 400 by 300 so after doing this now if we click on our minimap camera right here as you can see it needs the render textures right here okay inside this target texture so now if we drag and drop our texture in there and if you click on our game you know as you can see the minimap camera is no more now rendering okay it is now showing our main camera and whatever this minimap camera is capturing it is now passing it to this minimap render texture right here as you can see if you see in the preview right here you can see what it is being capturing okay now in order to show this uh, minimap right here okay on this minimap then just simply select the minimap and right here it needs a texture so let's drag and drop our minimap in there and now as you can see we have this beautiful minimap right here so now if we turn off the gizmos okay let's make this maximize and let's play the game and if you notice now in our minimap as you can see the player is now moving as you can see okay so our minimap is working perfectly fine as you can see but for now as you can see our minimap is not following the player so that is a big issue we want this minimap to follow our player so now we have this minimap now in the next video we will allow the minimap to follow our player around okay so let's end this video right here